Hi guys, Mary back to talk to you about the importance of properly reading a nutrition facts label. Many of you are familiar with what a nutrition facts label looks like. We're going to focus on the highlighted areas, but I want to talk about some areas that are also not highlighted. You're going to start off by looking at your serving size and servings per container. That's going to be important because that dictates what information is noted below. The areas in yellow you're going to want to limit. Pay a little bit of attention to your trans fat and your sodium intake in particular. Uh, the area that's not highlighted that I think is very important are your total carbs and sugar. On the newer labels, you're also going to see something called added sugars. Whether you're pre-diabetic, diabetic, following a low-carb lifestyle, you really want to start looking at those total sugars. You want to make sure you're getting enough of the nutrients noted on the bottom. The pink column, which tends to confuse a lot of folks, is called the percent daily value, and these are percentages based on a 2,000 calorie diet. Doesn't mean that they're recommending a 2,000 calorie diet, doesn't mean that that's what you're having, but it's just a reference guide to show that if something is 5% or less, it's considered low, 20% or more is considered high. We're happy to assist with any other questions that you may have. Keep them coming, and I'll see you soon.